Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am finally bringing you a video that I promised long ago and it is all about Stitch Fix. Now I am combining not only a little review about the company and what it is all about, but I am also going to be doing an unboxing. This arrived last night and I just cannot even tell you how hard it has been for me not to open this box yet. But I'm going to open it with you because I think it's kind of the best way for you to kind of experience Stitch Fix. Now for those of you who are not at all familiar with Stitch Fix, it is a box that is curated with five items by a stylist and sent to you. Now, it is not technically a subscription because you don't pay a monthly service fee. You can, however, receive them on a regular basis if you so choose, or you can just receive on-demand boxes. You do not pay a monthly fee. However, there is a $20 styling fee that gets credited towards anything you end up purchasing. So if you get a whole box of stuff and you return everything, you will have to pay that $20 styling fee. Otherwise, if you at least purchase one item from the box, that styling fee is put towards that item. So I have been doing Stitch Fix for, I think I figured this is my sixth box that I've received. I've pretty much been on an every other month basis and um, five of the six boxes were a great success. As I mentioned, each box is filled with five items and those five items can be anything from clothing to shoes to purses to jewelry, etc. And how all of that is determined is greatly decided by what you put in your profile and what kind of note or request that you leave for your stylist. Now, if you're like me, I was pretty skeptical that a complete stranger who has never met me, who has just looked at some of the details that I filled out on the screen is going to A, be able to find items of clothing that I actually like, and then B, find items that actually fit me. Because when I go to the store, I try on a huge pile of clothes to maybe find two or three items. So I have been super impressed by what the stylist has sent me. Now, there are a couple of keys of why this is successful. Number one, when you sign up for Stitch Fix, you fill out a very extensive profile. That profile includes um, not only your sizing and measurements, but it includes um, lists of colors that you like or don't like, and that is very important to select, by the way. Um, it also has you fill out price ranges of kind of what you typically anticipate to pay for different types of clothing. So uh, for me, I will pay a little more for shoes because I need comfortable shoes. Then I might want to pay for tops. So you can determine what price range you typically prefer to pay and they try to stay close in that price range. Um, and then the other thing that they do on there is they will ask you if there are clothing issues that you have. So when you're buying clothes, do you have a difficult time finding sleeves that are long enough or pants that are long enough or maybe you are short-waisted and so you have a difficult time finding tops that aren't super long. So you can list all of that information and then they have a section and you can do this every time you request a box or each time you are going to receive one, you can fill out, I think it's like 500 words um, that you can send a note to your stylist and give them some specific help as far as what you're wanting, um, what types of colors, or if you like ruffles on tops, or you say, no, I'm not girly, I really want just basics, I don't like any frills, whatever it be, you can put that in a note and that helps your stylist. You can also link a Pinterest board. So if you have a Pinterest page, you can create a fashion board and link that to them. 
and pin things that you like and then your stylist can go there to get an idea of what kinds of styles and outfits and things like that you are gravitating towards. Now the final thing that they do, they have developed a very advanced algorithm using something called Style Shuffle and it's on their app and you can go on there, I think every day they have separate, they have different sets of them and what it is is they're showing you an item whether it's a top, shoes, necklace, purse, whatever, and you just do a thumbs up or a thumbs down. And based on that, they are able to compile all of that and determine what kinds of things you might like and not like. So they have all of this built into their company and therefore I really do feel like that is why they are very successful in picking out things that you or I might like. Now, when you receive your box, as I have done, um, depending on what they have sent you will determine the size of the box. And this one's pretty heavy, so um, I requested a couple specific things, which I will share with you in a moment. But when you receive your box, you have three days to try everything on and decide whether you want to keep everything or send anything back. Inside this box I'll show you, there is a return envelope with a label. It's super easy to return things. You don't have to print anything out. It's all here and it's very easy to do. Once you decide what you're going to keep, you go online either on their app or on their website and you check out and actually purchase the items that you're going to be keeping. Now here is where there are a few tricks to this. So if you purchase everything in your box, you receive a 25% discount on everything. If you don't purchase everything, then you're gonna pay the full price of whatever it is you decide to keep. So my friend who had done this for about two years before I signed up, she told me the ins and outs and she said, it's not worth it to just send back one item. Um, because you're gonna lose that 25% off discount on everything else. So if you have a friend or a daughter or mother who has similar tastes or something that you might not like but you think they might like, it's worth it just to gift that item to them and keep the rest so that you can get that 25% off discount. And the final thing is as far as what you can get from Stitch Fix and who it's available to, they now have Stitch Fix for men, women, and kids. And the size offerings, I just looked specifically at the women's size offerings. They are all the way up to plus size 24W and 3X. And they also offer over a thousand different brands of clothing, shoes, accessories, etc. And those brands are all different price ranges. So depending on the price range that you are hoping to stay in, that kind of narrows it down as far as who they choose from to send you your box. All right, so with all of that being said, I cannot wait another minute. Let's go ahead and open this box. And just like with Boxy Lux, this is truly like opening a box at Christmas because you have no idea what is in here. Okay, so here is what the inside of the box looks like. And on the top label, or top um, lid right here, it will always give you instructions. So in case you forget from box to box what exactly you're supposed to do, they will tell you what you need to do, decide what you want to keep, etc. On the top here is the return envelope. So like I said, it already has a prepaid label. Shipping is free both ways. And all you do is put in here whatever it is you want to return and drop this off at the mailbox. Okay, then there's always an envelope like this and inside is a note from your stylist. I love this, it's so fun. Um, and when you open it up, you're gonna see these outfit ideas and usually this gives an indication you there's usually just maybe one item from each of these that they have actually put in your box and then some outfit ideas Ooh, excited okay and then here at the top right here is a long note from my stylist 
So her note says, I started today with the olive skinny pant that you requested. You will love how comfy these pants are. You can pair the Waldo pullover with the grommet details with the olive pants. Finish the look with the Jerry pull-on suede booty, another piece that you asked for. You can also pair the Fate textured pullover with the skinny pant and the booties. Lastly, I found the super soft Emery Park textured eyelash lace cardigan. Whoa, that's a mouthful. In a neutral off-white camel color. I love having a great neutral color cardigan in my closet that pair with almost anything in my closet. Warm regards, Kim. So, okay, now we're going to get into this. All right, the next article that is in the envelope is the bill. So this is where it's going to tell you how much each item is in your box. So before we get to that, let's just see what we have. Okay, this is something that's really neat that I enjoy. So the shoes, when they send them to you, they put them in these reusable cloth bags. And since I ordered boots, they put each boot in its own bag, which I think is great, great for travel. I'm gonna open those last though. So let's put those aside. Okay, and then the clothes are all packaged up like this. I'm so excited. Okay, let's tear into this. Ooh, okay. Oh, interesting. Okay, okay. So, um, let's see here. All right. So this is the brand Magnolia Grace, and I actually really like this. Okay, and I may throw in, I'll throw in some pictures here at the end after I've, able, if, after I've been able to try everything on, but it has a grommet detail. This is super soft, very fine gauge sweater. So not too hot, um, and then it does have a little ribbing detail here on the end really like that. So the olive jeans, I requested olive jeans, skinny jeans, and these have olive in them, but they are a print, a pattern. So it's olive and black. Um, I do like this brand. I've had this brand before. This is Liverpool um, in some skinny jeans and they fit well. So we'll have to try those on and just see how those work. Right. And then, ooh, I love this. Okay, so this is a very soft, cozy sweater. Um, this is the brand Fate and just very neutral, but I love these kinds of things. I have several pairs of skinny jeans. Um, I wouldn't pair this personally with my olive jeans that they sent, um, but this will go very well with other jeans that I have. And I just love the change in texture that I'm seeing here on it, and it's so soft, oh my goodness. All right, and then this was the piece that I really, really, really have been looking for and could not find, and it is a long cardigan. Um, I wanted something that was very casual that I could throw on over um, tops like what I'm wearing here. I have a black one, um, but I've not been able to find the right color, and this is a great color. Um, and I do think this can work with the olive pants. So um, now let's look at the boots. Okay, so here are the boots. They are that suede material. And I do like the little bit of slouchiness right here. I have, these boots are a little bit tricky for me to fit because I do have wide calves. Um, and again, I need comfortable shoes. So we will see, I'm not sure what brand these are, um, but they are actually leather. So that's pretty amazing. And the brand on these boots is Violet and Red not a brand that I'm familiar with, maybe some of you are, um, but they actually, they feel really nice and seem to have a good amount of cushion in the bottom, we will see. And then on the inside there is just kind of a zipper there, I guess to help you get your foot in. The zipper doesn't go all the way to the top. Um, but again, this, I can totally see 
with my sweater um, or this sweater with jeans. And we'll see how this goes with the olive pants. That's, that has some possibilities as well. Because remember, you don't have to pair black with black with black. You can mix brown camel neutrals with black or navy. Any of those work well together. So, so I am going to try everything on and I will insert some pictures at the end of this video and tell you kind of the things that I liked or didn't like. But overall, just from what I am seeing, I love basically four out of five of the pieces. The pants, we shall see. When we put them on, um, the print is not so crazy that, you know, it looks like a neutral. So um, I was kind of hoping for more of just a one color um, olive, more of a casual jean. This I think could be a little more dressy, which isn't a bad thing. But um, going back to what I talked about with pricing now, looking at my little pricing sheet here, if I buy everything on here, it's going to save me basically $95. So, so the cheapest item in this box was actually my cardigan. Um, the retail price is $48, but if you buy everything, it takes 25% off. So those of you who are mathematicians, that makes it $36. So I feel like that's a very fair price for what I'm feeling with the quality of the fabric and everything. Um, as far as uh, this, sweater as well. This does feel like super good quality. Um, I'm again not familiar with this brand, but this top, it retails for $68. However, if you take the 25% off, that's $16 and change basically off of that price. So that drops it down to like 50, 50 around $50 range. So that's not too bad for that. It's a little more than generally I spend on just a sweater, but I do love the, the extra detail um, with the grommets and everything. Um, now, as far as the pants go, um, these are $78. So that's where it's kind of like, all right, if they don't fit really well, I'm gonna be a little disappointed with that. Um, and then this sweater is 68 also. So this makes it around 50 if you get if I purchased the whole box. The big price tag in this box were the boots. And the boots retail for 119. However, take 25% off and now you're in the $90 range, which if you have priced leather boots recently, you will know it is hard to find anything good quality for too much less than 100 bucks. Typically, I don't buy leather boots, so um, this will be my my only pair of, of real leather boots right now. So, um, but if they fit well, I do feel like these will be a worthwhile purchase. I wear boots all season, even though I don't live in snowy area, I just love the look of them and I will get a lot of wear out of boots like that. So now to wrap up this video, I'm gonna insert a few pictures here of some of my previous items that I have received from Stitch Fix. Many of you have complimented me on several of these tops that you've been seeing me wear in videos and wondered where they came from and they were all from Stitch Fix. Now, I have been requesting continued summer wear, so that's why all of those tops are short sleeve or sleeveless and I've had a couple pairs of capri pants because our weather has been so warm. This was the first official box that I actually requested winter weather articles. So keep that in mind. You can request whatever it is you need in your wardrobe. So through the summer, I did also request a couple of dresses. So you can request whatever type of clothing and whatever season of clothing you want and your stylist will endeavor to meet those needs. So the more you communicate, the better your chance of getting a box filled with things that you love. Now in the description box below, I will leave a link to Stitch Fix and it will be my personal referral link. If you sign up, 
you'll get one too. So it's no different than anybody else receives. But if you're not comfortable using that referral link, it's okay. Just go directly to stitchfix.com and you can sign up there. But if you choose to use my referral link, thank you. I appreciate that. As an added bonus, you will receive, I believe it's a $25 credit towards your first purchase and I will as well. Otherwise, I hope that you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned to the end and I will put in some pictures here of all these articles that I received today tried on and I'll let you know on the screen what I decided to do. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye!